In days of old, in the kingdom bold, there lived a fearsome dragon. Mm -hmm. And the king, he was in great distress, and the country's spirits flagon. Oh. Until one day there came a knight, he was handsome, bold, and charming. And he slew the dragon with his sword, and a smile that was so disarming. With a hey and a ho, and a hey nanny no, a smile that was so disarming. Said the king, I wish to know your name, but the knight said, Do not bother, for the name of the knight of the realm says he is the same as any other. Said the king, to knight in my daughter's bed, you shall take your leisure, and she'll reward you for your deed with a knight of exhausting pleasure. With a hey and a ho and a hey nanny no, a night of exhausting pleasure. One daughter she had raven hair, a maiden young and chaste, and she slept all night in the pale moonlight, naked to her waist. The other daughter she was fair, the fairest in the town, and she slept all night in the pale moonlight, naked from her small waist down. With a hey and a ho and a hey nanny no, naked from her small waist down. Now the night he spent many an hour behind the castle wall. But the ending to this story, dears, isn't what it seems at all. For in neither bed of neither maid was the knight repaid his glory. Cause he spent all night with the king and said, cause this is a fairy story. With a hey and a ho and a hey and a ho. This is a fairy story. Huzzah!